Danielle Knotts, and I'm from Class 62. My science fair project was on how to turn milk into plastic. My research question was, what is the best recipe for making case in plastic? My hypothesis was that the whole milk with eight teaspoons of vinegar was going to be the best recipe. I thought this because I figured the more vinegar there was in the whole milk, the greater the curds would be. I thought that the whole milk was better than 2% milk because there is more casein present in the fat of whole milk besides 2% milk. For this project, I used whole milk, 2% milk, a kitchen scale, four clear drinking cups, four mugs, a measuring cup, and a thermometer. The, to do this project, you need to label the four mugs, one, two, four, and eight, and that is the amount of teaspoons of vinegar you're going to put in each cup. Then you warm up four cups of milk, depending on which trial you're doing first, and then you just wait for the milk to cool off. Then you add one cup of milk into each mug. Then you wait a little for the curds to start forming, and then you use a spoon to stir your mixture a little bit. But if there are a lot of curds, I suggest that you don't do that because then the curds are going to break apart and you won't get the best or the most yields you can out of that. Then you just pour your mixture of curds into a clear plastic drinking cup with a cotton cloth on top of it and that is called a sieve. Then you wait for the curds to go to the, to the top and let it separate from the rest of the mixture so that the vinegar and, the, and any excess water is left at the bottom and the curds are at the top. Then you take your cloth off and you place it on a surface so you can scrape all the curds off of the cloth. Then you move around the cloth and just like play with it a little so that it can like not have any like residue or like it can f have time to shape and form together. Then you put it on a kitchen scale so you can weigh it. As you can see here, I weighed all of my plastics. So the, f with the plastic with one teaspoon of vinegar had the lowest numbers, which were five and six. The two teaspoons of vinegar weighed eight and 10 grams. So there is progress, but through all of the numbers, whole milk always weighed the most. So that should be the outcome of the project. And as we can see in mug eight, for 2% milk, it was 11 grams. But for whole milk, it was 15 grams. This is the whole milk bag, and the eight teaspoons of vinegar is this one. And I, when I molded it, I layered them on top, the curds on top of each other. So the one with eight teaspoons of vinegar, as you can see, has the most layers to it. And it also feels like the best plastic. So, the scientific part behind this project was that, was, so maybe, just maybe, we don't have to get rid of plastic. Maybe we just have to use something else to take the place of oil, and it could be milk and vinegar. These are two simple things that are very accessible, so anyone can make plastic, and plastic can stay, and this is biodegradable. So plastic does not have to be thrown away. We just have to find a different way to use it.